Just look at it. Look at this absolute monstrosity of a base. Monstrosity in a bad way, clearly, because like monstrosity can be used versatile. You can be like, wow, look at this absolute monstrosity of a beast. He's a monster. He will destroy anything. No, 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 no. This isn't a good monstrosity. This base is an absolute abomination. That's probably a better word to describe it. It's a mess. It, like, I don't even know what I'm looking at right now. You got, you got stone gates. Uh, kind of just kind of just placed all over the shop you got a little stone platform with a tiny little wooden shack kind of like semi built into it with a with a painting gerboa inside of it little little jabob ross down there um and then he's got dinosaurs everywhere just sprinkled little little like salt base sprinkles sprinkle salt all over the base and you got dinosaurs everywhere it's it's, it's a disaster it's a mess Today, I'm gonna make her take a few steps, try and try and sort this mess out. And we're not talking about getting rid of the dinosaurs. In fact, we could probably install the soul mod to take care of them, just kind of move them out the way. In fact, that would have been a great idea now that I think about it. But I want to go back to actually doing a little bit of building. So today, we're going to spend a little bit of time on that before we get too far into it. If you do enjoy the video, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups. Now, I know it sounds like, oh, building, you know, that's pretty, it's a bit of a, bit of a slower episode, but that is where you are wrong. For we are going to begin by crafting a structure, a structure we haven't had up until now. I hate the view inside of my head. Uh, not a lot goes on in there. Look, there's no brain. That's that kind of that could be <laughs> that could literally describe this entire YouTube channel. I am brainless. There's small brain. In fact, maybe my brain is just so small. It's microscopic. You can see my mouth. You can clearly see my mouth. I mean, I run it 24/7. My mouth is just non-stop during these videos. This. <laughs> But anyways, as I was saying, oh my gosh, we're still inside of the head. Let's get out of there. We're going to craft up a structure. One that does something that no other structures can do. One that will bring danger to this world. It'll bring struggle to my life. It'll, it'll, it's really what works against us, but we're going to do it anyway. I can't even remember what this thing's called, but what this one structure does is unlocks a secret gate, a secret portal to another dimension. The dimension of the bosses. The boss dimension. Now, you might have realized upon our journeys, upon our travels, we are yet to encounter a boss. We are yet to encounter a dragon, a manticore, a dodo rex, dodo wyvern, a giant gorilla, megapithecus, or even a broodmother. Well, that changes today because we are going to craft up. I don't even know if it's in my own inventory or somewhere else. It's somewhere else. I assume it's in this purple fella down here. Little bulb dog. You know what I'm talking about, friend. I am, of course, talking about this fella right here, the Ascension Portal. This here, as you can see by the description, allows boss dinosaurs to spawn in your world. Valleys are configurable, yada, yada, bada, bada. Well, we're going to craft one up. We're going to place it down. And this here is the portal to the future. It's a, it's a dark future. It's a future of probably a lot of death and destruction, but also it allows us to tame those bosses. So while I guess we are doing a little bit of building, the world is going to be populating with boss dinosaurs. And it doesn't stop with the ones that I just mentioned. There are also custom crazy bosses. If you've played with the Pugnacia mod, if you've been on the channel for longer than 12 months, you know what I'm talking about. Where am I going with this thing? Let's just place it over here. You know what I'm talking about. So this is the day the world will never be like it was before. Bam. There it is. The ascension portal has been placed. Look at it powering up. Can you see? Can you see the little lights inside of our little obelisk here doing that? Yeah, that's it. There's no turning back now, baby. There is no turning back now. And of course, these are the custom bosses. We can obviously tame them up ourselves as well. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, let's uh, let's actually work out what we're going to be doing with this base. Like I said, while those dinosaurs are spawning in, doing their thing, I don't, know, I don't know what they do. They just kind of, I don't even know where they come from, okay? They just appear. They just appear. That's all there is to it. Hopefully, none of them fly into our base. That would be absolute. That'd be terrible. But hey, I'd, I would like to see one by the end of today. That'd be fantastic too. But as I was saying, um... <laughs> While they're doing their thing, we're going to be doing our thing over here. Now, I guess first thing first, we're going to craft up some. We've got, already got a bunch of foundations. Fantastic. Um, I guess we're going to just kind of work away. We're going to chip away at the base and, and see what kind of inspiration we can draw upon. Uh, it looks like we're going to need some resources as well. So my mantis over here, who surely... Now I'm just trying to think. Who had all of our crazy loot recently? We had a lot of loot. We had a lot of crazy stuff. Was it... I mean, we got spare pickaxes here. Oh, oh, my dude. Oh, oh, where did you even get any of that? Like, okay, that's cool. I don't know where he got half of that stuff. How about you? Have you got it? No. 
Hmm. Did I did I forget to pick up a body of mine? I had a bunch of random pickaxes and hatchets and and other loot and stuff, but I don't know where I've placed said items. Uh, I was gonna. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, it's just a pickaxe, a really good pickaxe, but it's just a pickaxe. And then we got this spare hatchet here as well. Okay, good. Okay, fantastic. Well, my mantis friend, let's see what you can do with some proper tools, friend. Let's. In fact, I only really I needed a hatchet. I didn't, didn't actually need a pickaxe, but still, it'd be cool to know what sort of pretty much the same isn't it i don't think he actually gets crazy stat boosts from this sort of stuff um but this guy here is like our number one harvester he's kind of like our all-terrain vehicle i use that phrase so darn frequently but it's true my guy here he can he can harvest just about anything he's like a don't cure us an inkolo a, a therizinosaur he's a beaver he's a roll rat he's he's everything he's, he's really fantastic as a matter of fact and i'm pretty sure all right, hold on. Let me just check something here. Can you get a primal mantis? No. Okay. I wasn't sure if that was a thing or not. Unless... Yeah, no, no, no. You can't. I was going to say, unless there's like not a saddle for it. I was going to say, imagine imagine something even more powerful than this guy right here. Now, that would be something crazy. Something pretty special. But look at this. Look at that. How much wood did we just collect? 14,000 wood. Like... <laughs> That's what dreams are made of, baby. If only he could harvest berries, actually. We we're gonna test that out, weren't we? I don't really need a berry harvester no more. Right, I was gonna get a. I don't have silk yet. Oh, my dude's here's heavy. He's heavy. He's heavy. Um, um. All right, have some levels into weights then, I suppose. All right, we better go and transfer our wood back to base, and then we're gonna get some stone. Uh, basically, I just want to go absolute ham on crafting up structures. That way, I never need to again. But we always know that we always need to again. It's just kind of like. It, you're, you're never gonna be entirely satisfied with structures put it that way anyways bam 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 kazam to dam to dam to dam oh wow i filled up my own inventory just then that's how many we just picked up all right drop you drop you drop you drop you drop you um can we get oh i'm gonna need some stone that's right hold on ah, get back in there what are you doing what the doing son foundations uh i need more of these fellas four of them eh, eh, eh. give me eight of them <laughs> that's not much better but it's good enough all right there we go. All right, fantastic. Let's go find some stone. And then once we've got the stone, then we can actually start placing all these friends down. And by looking for stone, man, we got, we got stone everywhere. Look at all these little fellas. Get a little bit of metal while we're at it too. Why not? I mean, these aren't the best stones to be collecting for stone. But, I mean, we've already got a few thousand. So they're getting the job done. What can I say? Bam. ka ding do 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 them hey guys i got some pretty cool news uh to share with you by the way i'm currently looking for an office space to uh move my youtube operations to in case you don't know i still work from home i got a little uh little, little bedroom at home that i've got my computer set up from and uh obviously i've got two kids here with me and a wife but things get a little bit crazy a little bit distracted at home there's a lot going on around pretty much 24 7 and um it's kind of uh not driven me to the point but it's it's gotten to to the point where i think i need to find an office so i'm currently on the lookout for an office there's a few that i've put some uh, offers and interest in towards um unfortunately it'll be like a month or so before we're settled into something like that but uh basically oh hello my friend where did you come from what that will allow us to do or will allow me i knocked him out before i killed him what i dealt torpor with hatchets somehow anyways the point i'm getting to is once that does happen i'll be able potentially to return to a little bit of streaming on the channel so keep an eye out for that like i said though don't hold your breath for the next like month it will be about a month before anything like that is uh you know um i guess introduced but uh yeah i know a lot of you guys love when we do some live streams so keep an eye out for that we'll, we'll see what happens it might be in the near to not too distant future i'm really really excited i think it's uh i think it's gonna be awesome and hopefully better videos more videos maybe even get the second channel up and running again i am so over promising right now but trust me they're up they're all things i really 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 want to do and uh i'm sure yeah it's kind of like you guys will enjoy it i'll enjoy it it'll all be fun and dandy it'll be awesome and Anyways, 20,000 stone from that little collection. That's crazy. That's awesome. Fantastic. It's exactly why we got this mantis. So we'll go and drop those in there. And you know what? I got 26 levels on my own. I'm going to go and use these today. We're going to go and increase our weight ridiculously. I'm going to give myself a little bit of health as well. We're going to give ourselves a little bit of... Actually, a little bit of fortitude. I think that's it. All right, cool. We are level 113 now. That's a crazy amount of levels, but I love it. All right. And now that we have all of these resources, we could probably do this. 100 foundations. Fantastic. 
And yeah, I guess I was kind of hoping we'd be able to hold all of these foundations as well. And we can. So that's just great. Now, one thing. Where's my man? Where's my uh, beautiful griffin that we tamed up yesterday? This beast right here. Isn't he just a splendid looking friend? The fella. He absolutely majestic. I love the colorings. Like that, like that green is just... I don't know. It's something. I guess it's the green and black. It's pretty... And the black, like, of his body matches his top hat as well. This is some pretty good color coordination going on here. I really appreciate my guy. But let's see what we got in here real quick. Let's see what we have. Ooh, ooh, now I got a better one. But a climbing pick and a medium crop flood that I do not need. So I will just go and drop that one straight up. Anyways, um, that's cool. We can break these down for resources once we have ourselves a um, grinder. Although I'm pretty sure... Huh. Let me just check something really quickly, okay? One, I'm pretty sure one of the conflagrant dinosaurs acts as a grinder. But I can't for the life of me remember what it is. Um, we got this guy who crafts black pearls. That's interesting. The Ankylo is a forge. I should probably get... I should probably get a conflagrant Anki. The Beezle Bufo. Uh, it's a chemistry bench. That'll be handy for narcotics. Uh, die bear. We'll create honey. Okay, that's handy. Dodo is good for gasoline. Dodo Curious. He's, oh, he's the grinder. This dino is a mobile industrial grinder. Put whatever you want. <sighs> okay. Well, I guess we can save ourselves having to craft one of them then. I probably still will craft one, but we can use that dirty for the time being. I need to get ourselves. I need to get one of them. I need a conflagrant dodo. Yep. But for now, what I was going to do was I wanted to bolster up this little part of the base. It's kind of like the starting point, I think. As you can see, we've kind of begun over this side. We've got our little uh, stone foundations over here, which I kind of like. I like that. And I kind of want to carry that trend on over this side. Plus, dinosaurs can just casually walk. Look at this. I'll, show, I'll demonstrate. This is the problem with the base currently. If I can do that, wild dinosaurs can do that. And now that we've got bosses out there in the world, I don't want wild dinosaurs being able to do that. So we're gonna we're gonna put a stop to that. Basically, that's that's what we're gonna do. So let me hop off of you. And what I think I'm gonna try and do here, what I think would be a good way to do this. Um, hmm. I was gonna just try and straight up. <laughs> yes, I know I'm kind of blocking my gate here. This actually could not be that bad. Hmm. Can I break this? Hold on a second. That's not a rock. Okay. Worth a shot. I was just going to try and keep them at the same level, but I guess I wasn't really prepared when I placed the first one down. Hmm. It'll work over there. Okay. We'll see. We'll see what happens here. Um, but, hmm. Yeah, no, that's not going to work. We'll go and rip all of that up. That's fine. But, uh, what did I, what did I place over here? Did we just keep going in a straight line? Yeah, I guess we did. Okay. 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 I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, but if we can just eventually we'll see these pop up again right all right they poke this is where they ended up poking okay that's not ideal that's not a really good design choice now is it hmm i guess we could just go a little bit higher we just gotta rip all these up again which is fine we can do that i've got a little got a little i can get a little uh oh, is that the omni tool no it's the s plus i always forget the name of this thing multi tool how does one forget the name multi-tool, but remembers the name... Uh, okay. But remembers the name... Uh, I remember omni-tool, but not multi-tool. Multi is like the... It's a natural word that you'd remember. So what I think we'll do is this. We're going to get a starter block. In fact, hmm. Better idea. What we could do... Just... No, nah, that's not working. I wanted to basically match roughly what I did over here, which is, I guess, I don't even know if, I think I did that completely by chance as well, that it's almost lined up perfectly with the edge of the the thing, my Bobby here. Literally, I think, I think it's completely by chance. Oh, it's actually not even perfect anyways. Okay. All right. I was just, yeah, like I said, completely by chance. Um, so... Now, okay, hold on. Ah, this is why I have so much trouble when it comes to building. Because I'm like, so like, I get all, what's the word? I get, um, OCD. I get so OCD when I'm doing this sort of stuff. Because I just want to, I want to get it right once. And then not have to worry about it again. Problem is, regardless, I always end up going and changing it afterwards. Okay, so basically, I want you here. Or should I move it up a bit? I should probably move it up a bit. Yeah, I guess something like this. 
Something like that. Something like that. Okay. That'll do. And then we're going to adjust position. I'm going to lower it to about... Oh, it's going to end up... It's going to end up quite high, but it'll be fine. Okay. About there. All right. We'll see what happens. Okay. So now we can actually see the foundation. So that's a... It's an improvement. It's a big old improvement. Um, but then... We obviously... Dang it! Why did I think about that? We're going to move it up here and then I just completely butchered it and now it's all hidden again. You know, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> what am I even doing right now, man? What am I even doing? Um... Why is this so troublesome? Why am I struggling with this? I don't get it. Okay, I was gonna like do something like this. I don't know if I like it though. I really don't like it as a matter of fact. <laughs> Maybe we'll just come to like it. In fact, I don't even think we've bolstered it enough to even like serve the purpose that we were going for, which was of course to be able to block wild dinosaurs. Actually, no, 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 that's enough. Unless, you know, anything bigger than a dodo tries to get into the... <laughs> anything bigger than a dodo will happily hop over that. But I guess we can just... Yeah, we'll build that up a little bit. It'll be okay. We got this. We got this in the bag. Let me go and get the rest of those foundations, though. Because uh, we didn't collect them all. We only got a few of them. We got another hundred. Which, due to our levels in weight, I can carry them all. So that's fantastic. <laughs> the question is, actually, do we want to... Hmm... Yeah, you know what? I vibe it. Let's keep it going. Uh, we're going to need some... <gasps> I need some triangles. Ooh. What have I mistaken here? Okay, this is different. This is rather different. All right, so I got to pick, 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 pick. Okay. All right, we're learning as we go. Not too shabby. Okay. This actually isn't... Okay, I don't know. It's growing on me because it's not as like just carbon cut paste squares and stuff i like once when, when you get to mix in a little bit of triangular action you know what i mean okay but now what are we going to do here more triangles are we just like stuck for an eternity of using triangles now is that is that the is that what i've kind of just signed us up for by placing i, I think so but it's not the end of the world yeah i think it's literally gonna be triangles for like <laughs> okay that's cool all right, this is a pretty good, pretty good area. And what I'm thinking we could actually do is ramp this up a little bit if we really want to. We can, we can kind of uh, increase the height on it, or we can just leave it as is because I kind of like this. We can literally just throw some railings on the front of it. I mean, even if I just were to do this, I think it'll take ten years to craft up, and we can just rail off the, the. Okay, I don't mind it. Oh, even better! Stop the railings! Stop the railings! We can go and get some crystal. Which I'm pretty sure my magma saws are good at doing. We've got the magma saws we can use now. And we can do we can do this. We can go get some glass. And we can get some where are they at? Glass gates. No. Ooh, we could get glass gates. It's not what I'm looking for, but we could get some glass gates. No, we can get these ones here. Large glass walls. Which we need ooh, a lot of stuff for. Oh, met we need a lot of metal for them. Okay. Yeah, metal seems to be the big issue for us right now. The sooner we get ourselves a furnace, the better I think. Well, not a Why does this keep stopping, man? Why does it keep stopping? Um, I got 1,600, though. Let's just say I wanted a grinder. I'm pretty sure there's like 5,000 metal. At 3,200. We're halfway there. Uh, are you thinking what I'm thinking, buddy? Are you thinking what I'm... Th I think we need to go and get a conflagrant dodo. I think... I think we've got to do it. I think it's literally what stands between... Okay. Well... <laughs> It's a must moving forward. I know I said we're going to tidy up this base a little bit, but I guess a base tidying up day is coming to a... We're going to put a little little pause button on it, all right? We've got other things we need to attend to right now. Let me see if I can get a little... Can I get a little tonic to help us out with whatever we're about to do? Need some stimulants. There's 13. I need another 10. All right, let's craft up these ones. You know what? Maybe we just go looking for like any... Um, Drugs, stimulants. Maybe we just go looking for any conflagrants at all that we can find. Because right now, for crafting up this sort of stuff, a, conf a conflagrant... Um, what are they called? Conflagrant toad. What are they? Bees of buffo! A conflagrant bees of buffo will be super duper helpful. Um, wait, what? what are you doing? No, what are you talking about? Do I need all of them? Need more? Need those, need those, and then need those. A Beezle Buffet will be handy 
for crafting up stuff because he's a chemistry bench. A dodo would be good. No, dodo. Dodo curious would be good for grinding, and an ankle would be good for smelting. Maybe, maybe that's, pro that's probably what we got to do. What do you? All right, there you go. Now you can give me one. Thank you very much. Wow, that was a complicated process. Uh, and I guess we're just going to need some berries. I'm pretty sure they eat berries. So, tracky dude. Yeah, I was going to say, you should have the hookup. Thank you very much. And I guess I'm going to bust you out, big guy. Let's do this thing. I don't even know where we're going to go looking for one of these things. But we'll just have a little peek around and see what we can find. But... <laughs> This adventure is going to be a little bit potentially different to previous ones because this is the first time leaving the base with the Ascension portal crafted and placed and built. So what are we going to find out here is the question. Are we going to find some dragons? Are we going to find some of the like top tier bosses? It's only one way to find out. And that's by having a little look around the map. So let's do exactly that. But Primarily, we're looking for conflagrants. I think we've got to look in the mountains, to be honest. I feel like that'll be our best bet. The worst part is we have seen these things in the past. We have flown past them in the past. They, they're they not like random dinosaurs we've never encountered before. We have encountered them. I've just ignored them. We just haven't been looking for them. So hopefully, um, we can we can find them soon, quickly. And it doesn't take too long. But have a look at this Rex. Oh my gosh. Now that is what you call an X-Rex. I never thought I wanted to see a green and blue. Oh, he dead. Never mind. Okay. Um, cool. <laughs> I just love the color, the crazy colors that the uh, that this mod introduces. The po oh my gosh. This guy's green and pink. Also, I see an Anki. Hold on. I see an Ankylo. All right. What do we got over here? We have... Can't tell because we got all this level stuff on our, on our screens. Um, let me get rid of this one. Okay. It's just a regular Ankylo. And you are a little baby, Ankylo. Okay. We got an egg over there. We got an ancient Rex. We got more Rexes down here. We got Stegos. Um, all right. Well, at least we're finding Ankies. So that's a good start. Is that a primal griffin? No, it's just a regular griffin. I was going to say, if I find a primal... <gasps> oh, primal... Terror bird, though. I did want to find another primal also. Get a load of this guy. Oh, my gosh. The colors... I've never seen a prettier scorpion in my life. Oh my gosh, you are majestic. Oh, I don't even want you, but I do. I really do. Apparently, they're really good at knocking stuff out too. Um, oh, that would be so good to tame up. It's literally like vaporware colored. That's so good. Also, hello. I think we just found what we're looking for. Is that what I think it is? It's a good flagrant dodo. A, why do I keep calling it a dodo? Dodi. Dodicurus. Dodicurus. We found what we're looking for regardless, okay? So, let's put some levels on it i mean torpor on it arrows on it put some arrows into it is that what i'm trying to say there we go fantastic my dude here's gonna need 79 uh berries or man i gotta get the veggies out i gotta get the kibble crafted how do i keep forgetting to do kibble man it's because i got that small brain that i was talking about earlier i think all right so if i just let you eat these hmm he might actually eat them pretty quick Can't decide what to do here. Do I use it or not? Yeah, we're going to use it. I'm, I'm too impatient. All right. Smash out them berries, buddy, and we'll get you back to base. But while we are here, we may as well just have a little peek around. And Oh, my gosh. Oh, I don't care what the dinosaur is. But when it has this pink color, I think is one of my favorite colors ever. I'm not even talking about the game. I'm just talking about in general. Again, looks like a Formula One car. <laughs> I know I already said my Magmasaurs look like Aston Martins. Kind of like this, this griffin over here. Exactly the same like green color. But this guy here, he looks like an Alpine, which is like Renault's. It looks like this color here, okay? Bam, there. There it is, okay? Tell me he doesn't look like that type of Formula 1. Man, we're literally going to like find a, a, a dinosaur that represents every Formula 1 team. And I got no problems with it, all right? Okay, I'm a mega fan of the sport. That's all you need to know about me. But anyways, there's a few griffins out here, eh? <gasps> Ankylo. Just a regular Ankylo. Is, was there one behind it? Just trying to look beyond the smoke. I don't think so. Either ways, I feel like it's only a matter of time before I find one around here. We've got a Karkonos. We've got a wreck. <gasps> hold on. Hold on. I think I spotted one. This guy down here. He's got his little flaming tail. We do the double whammy. We found the double whammy. This guy. Oh, new. Mm, he requires... Oh, no. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Can I pick you up? 
Oh, yeah, we can just... I, I wasn't trying to pick this guy up, but I'll take him. <gasps> Look at the aggressive Quetzal. Oh, we, oh, wait, hold on. Where's my... Oh, good. My Dodecurus is up here. I was like, please don't be fighting near my Dodecurus. That'd be very, very, uh, you know, just not ideal. Okay, please don't. Please don't. Please don't. Oh, my gosh, I missed. Okay, hold on. Did I catch him? I did. Man, this guy here's just trying to jump off the cliff. Not cool, man. Not cool. You realize you are, like, running to your death, right? Okay. That one landed. You know what? It's going to drop another one as well. Whatever. All right. The double whammy. We've knocked them both out. I didn't actually think we'd come across both of them today, but I'll take it. That is really, really good. Um, you can have those. And look at this. He's just ready. He's ready to smelt. He's ready to get smelting. The downside here is, though, that... Yeah, we got to wait for him to eat all of it. Every single bit of it. All 100 and whatever pieces. Or I can just give him one of these. I'm pretty sure it... Do I waste an instant golden kibble purely for my impatience? Yeah, I'm, I'm that impatient, baby. I'm that impatient. <laughs> we did it. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. Also, are these... Are these rare flowers? Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Nice. All right, buddy. You want to get smelting? Do I have any metal on me? Otherwise, I'd, I'd literally give it to you like right now if we if I did. Um, I totally would. All right, come over here. I think, yeah, I was going to say. It's going to right next to us. Literally right next to us. Here. Let's see how fast you smell, big boy. Bam. Oh, and I can level up crafting speed. We can get these things. This this guy's going to craft up so quick by the time we're like done with him. It's going to be awesome. It's going to be fantastic. All right. Have a little bit more. I'm going to fly you back to base in a second. All right. Bam. Crafting skill. Upgraded. Did that increase the speeds by much though? I don't even know. Where to, oh, here we go. All right, man. I just want to get him leveled up to find out. I need some experience potions or something. Oh, so my dude here, how are you doing? You're dead? You're dead? What do you mean? Are you telling me that the T-Rex and the... Oh, no! The T-Rex and the Quetzal killed you? Was I... Was I just oblivious to... Oh, my gosh. Well, I guess we wasted our tonic. And we don't... We need... Oh, my God. Okay, that is actually... That grinds my gears. That grinds my gears. Okay. Okay. It is what it is. We can't get upset. No, we can get upset. I am upset. You stink. It was you. It was you, I'm pretty sure. It was you. You even looked up at me when you ran along. Almost like rubbing it in. You had that cheesy grin on your face. Oh, I'm upset now. Here I was thinking everything was just going swimmingly smooth. We had everything that we were looking for. Uh, and it got all it got snatched out from beneath us. All right. All right. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? At least we still have one of the two successfully tamed. I used an item I would have ideally not liked to have used, but it doesn't matter. We will get more of them when we are ready to kill more ancient dinosaurs, which I feel like we're not far from. But regardless, we at least have a good source of metal. And that is all that matters right this second. We can get the metal. Then we can't grind, though. I wanted to grind. I wanted to grind. And then we can get our big old glass walls up. How bad does this look? <laughs> it looks terrible. I thought it was symmetrical. I couldn't even know the symmetry on this. Then again, if you were to do... Hmm. If you were to do that, that pattern, between all of the gates, it's not going to be symmetrical because the gates are just all over the shop. It wouldn't look bad, though. Like, it's... It's not great, but it's not terrible either. I don't... Okay, all right. It'll grow on me, I'm sure. Either way, though, so my conflaggy anky. Sit tight, buddy. Sit tight. You were the survivor of today, mate. You somehow survived. Well, not somehow. I, I'm, I'm absolutely, I'm, I'm actually, I'm so disappointed about that. Uh, where uh, is a saddle? You might not actually have uh, a, a, like a special saddle. I think it's literally just got a, an Anki saddle. So we'll just get you an Anki saddle. I've got an Anki saddle. Hey, an ascendant one. Buddy, you are about to be spoiled. You are like today's golden child, mate. Have a special saddle, mate. There you go. Keep smelting, by the way, too. Have some more of that. All right. I'm curious if I can get him out here. Um, He's good at collecting flint. All right. got some levels for that. I just want to get this crafting skill up. Like, let's just see how much metal he can smelt, basically. Like, I want to see how fast he can smelt the stuff up. I mean, he does pretty solid damage. Oh, a thousand? 
Not bad. That's better than half my dinosaurs, dude. Okay. I didn't really get you for that purpose. He collects berries. He smelts metal. He collects metal. He collects flint and stone. This guy's... Man, here I was getting excited about my mantis doing it all. But this guy, he might just... He might just be the one. Thousand percent crafting skill. Let's keep it going. We got a long way to go yet. I'm guessing he doesn't have a lot of... All right, more levels. Never mind. I was going to say, he mustn't get like a lot of um, harvesting experience. But no, no, no. It seems he does because he's leveling up. He's, he's leveling pretty darn quick. All right. All right. Let me bend it up here real quick. Is there something I can kill? I want some of that kill experience. You're probably going to take too long to kill. You, on the other hand. Let's give you a little nibble, eh? Three. Four. And one more. There you go. Oh, another one coming. Fine. That's cool. I don't care. I'm not, I'm not picky. I'll kill whoever wants to die right now. Only one level there. That's fine. 1,168. Look how fast the metal is smelting. Yes. That's so good. That's so good. Um, hey, Jabob Ross, buddy. Would you like... Would you like us to die? Yeah, he gave me a level two. I saw a raptor over here. I guess I'll go pay him a visit too. I was trying to think. Every now and then we kill something that gives us a ridiculous amount of experience. And I always forget like what what it, like, what it is. That, that kind of hooks us up with the experience. I always forget. All right. Man, all right. We are, we're getting this. We're getting... Imagine, what, imagine how fast this guy is going to smell. Oh, conflagrant. Hey, buddy. I absolutely hate these guys. Also, look at the range of my attacks somehow. My dude here, he, he hits from like a mile away. He's got some ranged attackage on him. I should probably just tame this dodo up. But then again, nope. I will go and steal his fuel though. In case you don't know how they work. They poop gasoline. I will take it. How are we doing here with the metal? Oh my gosh. It's so quick. It's so quick. It's so quick. Yeah, who needs a forge when you got this guy? That's the whole... Th th this is the whole point we got him. Um, trying to see what's up here in the distance. There is a dirty curious up there. Unfortunately, I, d I doubt it's what it's the one that I need. But any dirty right now would be pretty special, to be honest. All right. Take some of this parasaur. Take some of that. Take it. Take it. Yeah. Bam. Okay. Um, are we getting a little bit... You know what? No, these guys are fighting it out. Let's go. Let's get in there. Hmm, okay, we might be a little bit in over our heads here, but I'm still going to try. Come on, these guys will hook us up with some pretty good experience, I reckon. Come on, let's get it. 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 One of them's nearly down. Come on. That's one down. Got a level out of it. At least one level. This guy wasn't taking damage, though. That's right. We'll get it. We'll get it. We'll get there. 997 damage. We're dealing about 1,000. It's good. Let's keep it going. Halfway there. Come on, buddy. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Give me give me at least like a level or two. It'd be fantastic if you will. Come on. There we go. Even I gained a level out of that one. Nice. Seven levels from the two of them. Also, we got some arrows too. Sweet. Okay. Um, I'm honestly tempted to put levels into melee damage, but crafting skill. I wanted, I wanted to see the return on this metal, man. It's looking so good. Ah, uh, how about you? I see you up here, defense units. I see you, buddy. There's no hiding. You cannot hide from me. Oh. That's cool. I got you. I got you. You can't stop this. You got a little bit of health, yeah. But you can't stop this. You can try it. Oh, there's that Dota Curious. Yeah, it's definitely not a conflagrant Dota Curious. Disappointing. What are you going to do? More levels. Two from that one there. We're legit going to get this guy to 2,000%. Which means he is going to smelt metal at 20 times the normal rate of metal smelting. 20 times faster. You poor little Megalosaurus. You don't deserve this, mate. I actually feel terrible about this one. But I get the feel. You're going to hook us up with experience. So I'm going to take it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Give it to me. Give it to me. Ha! Three levels. And officially, two... 1,132% smelting speed. You love to see it. You love to see it. And you know what? I feel like that's it. I feel like we've, uh, I, think, I feel like we've achieved enough out of this guy. I think he's done his job for today. Unless I want to go and kill a Bronto, but I can't be bothered biting him 83 times. That sounds like an excessive amount of bites. 
Yeah, let's get this guy back to base. He's he's done his he's done his dash. And if he never levels up again, that's fine. Because he's he's well beyond what I ever expected him to be able to achieve. <gasps> he's run out of metal! I'm pretty sure I got like a stack of it at base though. So we basically just need to keep him supplied. We gotta keep the his metal metal supplies rocking. Otherwise, well yeah, he's just gonna run out of metal to smelt. Look at this though. Look at Oh man, he's smelting it so fast I can't even can't even witness it. Alright, let me just break some of these. Trying to break the rocks, not the bushes. Rock, rocks. Okay, there we go. Look at that. Imagine then on top of that getting scrap metal in here as well. This guy will be... This This guy's amazing. He's amazing. Now, unfortunately, we didn't encounter any bosses today. But maybe we could... Maybe we just said that's fortunate, actually. We, I mean, that's not necessarily unfortunate. We, we, we got through without too much trouble. We lost the Dota Curious. That upsets me. But, oh my gosh, this base is absolutely... It's a disaster. These, ma these magma swords. Who I never even asked for three magma swords. Why do I have three magma swords? <laughs> oh, it's crazy. But show me what you're truly made of. Show us what you can... Oh, we don't have any scrap metal. Look at that, man. Look at that. That is quick. That is good. That is special. Guys, we're going to end this one right here. Look, today had its ups and downs and all arounds. But overall, we came out on top. Maybe tomorrow is the day we encounter our first boss. Who knows? You're going to have to tune in to find out. But if you did enjoy the video, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. But most importantly, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.